Welcome back guys to another Zero DTE video and today Ernie's going to be talking about holding through expiry so make sure you stay tuned. If you're interested in becoming a pro trader check out the link in the description where you can find Ernie's education platform. Enjoy guys. Can you go over at the end of the day on the Zero DTE the expiration what happened if we let it expire? Or do we need to close it before four o'clock? Is that a, a must or? All right. So it depends on what asset that you're trading. So if you're trading an option on the SPX. Yes. Yes. SPX or XSP. That's it. Yeah. On, on the SPX, there's a little reason to, if you're at the end of the day and you're inside a profit tent or anywhere, to tell you the truth, it, there's little reason to close it unless you think that there's too much risk to hang on to it. Right. I mean, because of the gamma risk, because of the steep profit curve. Right. If you're okay. too, too close to the edge, that would be about the only reason why I can see why you might close a trade, but if you're inside the profit tent with the SPX, it makes a lot of sense to hold on to it as long as possible because Will was saying that when you get near those last few minutes, the growth in the value of your butterfly is increasing dramatically really fast. So you could make an extra couple, two, three, four hundred dollars just in the last couple of minutes just by oh. hanging on. But there's no harm in, in, in holding it right through expiration because the S SPX is cash settled. You're not going to get assigned anything. Nothing's going to happen. The worst that possibly can happen is that price moves out of there and then becomes a total loss. But you've already taken that risk and you already know what it is. At the beginning, of course, yeah. Yeah. So that's the worst possible thing that can happen. The best possible thing that could happen is that you can make a crap load of money. So those are good odds. And there's not any assignment. You're not going to get any kind of extra margin call or anything like none of that comes into the equation. It's just, am I going to make a tiny little loss or am I going to make good money? Okay, perfect. On that note, coach, so does that mean on, on the SPX, does that on the 1 DTE, 2 DTE, 3 DTE, you can let it expire? Or is that only for 0 DTE? You just let it expire for the SPX. If you let them expire, they're all coming to 0 DTE. Oh, gotcha. So it doesn't matter if it's 3 DTE or whatever. It's just... Yeah, if you're 3 DTE, that just means it's you're not going to hit 0 DTE for three days. Exactly. Okay. Okay. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit the like button below. If there's any questions that you might have for Coach Ernie, make sure you leave them in the comment section. Thanks, guys.